To use Web Crusher on an iWeb website, we must first publish our website to a local folder. To do this, click on your website's name to go to the Publish page. Select Local Folder from the Publish To drop-down menu. Specify the location on your hard drive where you want to publish the folder to. Then select File in the menu bar and select Publish Entire Site. This will ensure that all of your site's files will be published and you can optimize all of them. When your site has finished publishing, locate it on your hard drive and drag and drop the website folder onto the Web Crusher window. Click Go to optimize your site. When the optimization process is complete, you can now publish your website to your server. First click the Export button, followed by the Next button. Fill in your FTP login details, which include your server address, username, password, and directory path. If you are not sure what these are, you should email your web host to ask. When you have inputted your correct FTP details, click on this plus sign and give your FTP account a name. This will save you time the next time you use Web Crusher, as all you will need to do is click on this profile and all of your FTP details will appear. Click on the Upload button to publish your site. Remember, do not go back to iWeb to publish your site. Your site is now published, so there is no need to publish it from iWeb. Doing so would overwrite the optimizations made in Web Crusher, so you do not want to do that. The next time you update your site in iWeb, repeat this exact same process to ensure that your updated site will also load quickly.